Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a very small thrift store haul. I went to Desert Industry and only picked up two items there. And then I went to Salvation Army and I picked up just a few items. So let's just jump right in. Okay, so today it was a hot one. Today is very hot. So excuse the way I look. I came home and I changed out of my clothes that I was wearing earlier and I put on just stuff to be around the house to do this haul. So anyway, let me show you guys the two items that I found at Desert Industry. So the this item here, it's a pretty big item. I found this for my hubby. He likes to use this, uh, well, let me show you guys what it is. It's this huge stainless steel bowl. Um, this one was $4 and he likes to use these big stainless steel bowls. I remember when I worked in the kitchen, um, we used to use these and I told him these are really great. They're so easy to clean up. And so anyways, I figured I would get this for him. Um, I had seen one a while ago. It wasn't this big actually, this is a pretty big one. And uh, he had, I had told him that I had seen it, but I didn't think he wanted one that big. And he was like, you should have grabbed it. So when I seen this one, I said, okay, I'm gonna grab it. And it's only $4, which is not bad for this big old stainless steel bowl. All right, the other, the, the last thing that I got at Desert Industry was this belt here. I needed a belt, it's a thin little belt and it's brand new, has the tags still here and it's never been used. You can see it's perfect condition and I got it for $2 and so yeah. So that was the only two items that I picked up at Desert Industry. So let me show you guys what I found at the Salvation Army. So now with the Salvation Army, I don't know why I picked this up, but I just thought it was cute. Um, I got these little scissors for 99 cents. I don't know if you guys can see, look at that. They just look really pretty. I don't know. They look kind of uh, like Victorian to me, the look. Let me take off this price on here so that we could see the um, scissors here yeah they're, and they're pretty sharp I had poked myself with it so see how they look I mean I haven't taken off the complete sticker but I thought they were really pretty so for 99 cents I thought I would pick them up just to have them in my collection so I bought a dress and I had asked that if it didn't fit if I could return it for a store credit because they don't give any uh, cash back and it's in here and so the, the dress was eight dollars and the girl said normally they don't they don't do that but because we can't try things on right now she said um just bring it back today and ask for her she would do it but then she thought about it she goes you know what how about if i give it to you for four dollars and you just if it doesn't fit just keep it and i was like that sounds good so i went upstairs and i tried it on already and if it's just a tiny bit tight but that's okay because I'm watching what I'm eating and I've been I've already lost a couple pounds and I'm excited about that so I'm gonna be losing a few more but I saw this dress and I thought this would be perfect because my birthday's coming up next month and I figured I would wear it for my birthday first look at look at how pretty this is I mean it's very very pretty it's really poofy down here and um, see it has this down in the bottom and I I just thought it was so pretty and it has a belt that it comes with and let me show you guys the belt this is the belt look at the belt how pretty how pretty is that belt and uh, I just oh my god it's so pretty if I get a chance to put it on and show you guys I will but it is just such a pretty dress and four dollars four dollars for this dress so I'm going to send it to the dry cleaners so they can uh, take care of it for me. I won't wash this here at home. So this is going to the dry cleaners so I can wear this for my birthday. I know I'll be able to fit into this because I will lose a couple more pounds. So that's all I need is just to lose a couple pounds and then it'll just be perfect. So I got myself these sweats here. They are, I think they were $3.99, I believe, or $2.99. So, and it's yellow tags were 50% off, so I got it for, what was it, $1.50? So, yeah, they're just, you know, sweats so I can, you know, start using them so I can, when I work out and stuff. So, yeah, two bucks for this, or $1.50 for this is not bad. Okay, so I found this, these, 
and these are really nice so this next item these are brand new these were yellow tag so it's 50 percent off so i got it for 750. look at these boots brand new never been worn look at this brand new never never been worn and this is the back you still have i trade this one off but you still have everything that you know they use to stuff the in there all the stuffing and stuff in here um yeah brand new look at how pretty these are oh my goodness can't wait for the fall time again they were 15 so they were 750 but yeah look at that aren't these pretty seven dollars and fifty cents for these tall boots you guys oh my god that is a great deal and they're brand spanking new so excited okay so i picked up a couple little um figurines for my sister in california she collects these and when i saw them i instantly thought of my sister i love my sister she is an amazing sister my older sister angie she's awesome um she's shown me so much love and support and right now that i'm going through some stuff medical stuff she was the person that i spoke to and uh, the only actually the only person that really knows what's going on so um besides my husband and my children but um i have so many sisters i have four i have a total of four sisters and a brother and uh, i talked to my sister and the other day i was feeling kind of down about this whole medical stuff going on with me and you know she was there she was there for me she made me feel so much better she gave me so much <sighs> she gave me so much so much good advice and she just was my rock you know when i needed somebody when i was really really down um but anyways i i saw these little figurines that my sister really loves and she collects and so i got these aren't these pretty i don't remember what they are they're, i think they're the willow or something like that collection um, I got them each for $1.99. And I just thought, look at look at this one that's praying. It, this is perfect because we were praying. And I thought, you know what? This is perfect for my sister. And it's two, two girls. And this is me and my sister. Oh, my God. I thought of that and said, this is, like, so perfect. I'm going to give this to my sister. She's amazing. She made me feel so much better. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to give her these. This is her and I. So, dollar ninety nine. I thought I was so I'm so happy that I seen these. So these will be going to my sister. So for Father's Day, I made my husband a crab. Uh, was it crab boil seafood boil? And uh, we only had one pair of crackers, so we we're all kind of trying to share the crackers and stuff. So, anyways, I had told them that I was gonna be on the lookout for some more of those crackers, and just coincidence happened to find this set right here that they sold at Ross for eight dollars, but I got it for a dollar ninety nine. So it has the crackers here, and then it has the little forks to get in there and get the meat out. But I got it for a dollar ninety nine, and uh, this is perfect because we needed some of these crackers. So yeah, two bucks for this. So I picked up some movies, and um, at the movies at the Salvation Army are. 99 cents or a dollar you know and so i picked up four of them and um this one i i got for my boys because i know they like this movie i got this one the straight out of compton we are from la and um uh, yeah so <laughs> compton was right there next to us as our neighbor when we we're out in la so i got this for my boys and then i got this one i don't i remember seeing it a long time ago but i don't remember if I like it or not, but I figured, you know, for 99 cents, um, Halloween time comes, I like to watch scary movies. So I picked up this one called Valentine. And this one has, uh, actually Katherine Heigl. And I was interested because I was like, Katherine Heigl, Denise Richards comes out on this one too. And so I had to pick it up. The other one that I picked up and I wasn't sure if I had this one or not was The Conjuring. And I picked it up. 99 cents why not and then the last one that I picked up that I had seen before but I never picked it up and then I saw it the other day on TV and I thought oh my god that's a cute cartoon and I ended up picking it up is the Christian Anderson's Thumbelina it is such a cute cartoon and I just figured I could have this just to have in my collection whenever I have the my nieces and nephews over um, they I could put this on I mean, I know nowadays kids watch different type of cartoons. They have to be kind of fast-paced cartoons. These are a little slower, but you know what? It's okay sometimes to just 
slow down. And so I thought this was really pretty, this uh, cartoon. So I, I just had to pick it up. So those were my movies that I picked up. All right, and then I have a few more items in this bag here. I picked up this sign here. This was 99 cents right here. It says calories on here, but the reason why I picked this one up because I like the way this one looks. This has this around here, the like a grayish color. And I'm just gonna paint this. And I was gonna make a no soliciting sign for my daughter as well. Um, I'm gonna work on those signs. And then um, maybe maybe I'll do a tutorial. I'm not gonna promise making a tutorial because I am gonna be using my Cricut to make these no soliciting signs. Um, but yeah, I will, sh if, if I get a chance, I'll record it for you guys. Um, I just haven't been really up to doing some. I have so many ideas for tutorials and I already started getting all my stuff together to start doing my fall Halloween uh, tutorials, my DIYs. But honestly, you guys, I just can't seem to get up the strength to do them. So anyways, if I can, I will uh, try to record this tutorial. So that's what this is for. And again, you know what? These are so much cheaper to buy at the thrift store than if you go to the you know stores like to just to buy a piece of wood it's cheaper this way so i found this wreath form and this is i i'm i think this is from hobby lobby this label i picked it up for 99 cents and um, i like to pick up these frames just because i want to have them at hand in case somebody wants me to make them a wreath and stuff and so um I'm kind of like not into like the mesh wreaths anymore, but I'll make them for, you know, family or friends that want some. But I just like to, when I see stuff like this, I like to pick them up because they're, you know, just to have them in case anybody wants me to make them a wreath. Or if I decide that I want to make a fall, if I want to make a wreath, you know, a mesh wreath, then I'll, at least I'll have it there. So 99 cents for this wreath form. The last item that I picked up, and if you guys follow me, then you guys know that I love nutcrackers and I collect a lot of nutcrackers. I found this nutcracker here. I have one that's similar to this, silver, but it's not furry like this one right here. Look at how pretty. And this one is complete. I was looking at it and I said, okay, this one has everything. It's not broken. It's complete. And I thought it was just really cute. Hi, friends. <laughs> I thought it was really nice. So, yes, my obsession for nutcrackers is just crazy. I love nutcrackers. But anyway, that was all my finds this time around. I'm going to try to slow it down with my um, thrifting. I've been trying not to get a lot of stuff that I don't need. I've been going more for clothing and, um, you know, pans and stuff like that that I may need. But I'm trying to slow it down. There was a lot that I seen that I wanted to pick up, but... I was like, no, 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 no. I need to leave that behind. I don't want to keep bringing in stuff. Although I am going through a serious purge in my house. I'm going through all my stuff and getting rid of a lot of stuff. So anyway, that was everything in this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this small thrift store haul. I hope you guys go out there and find some amazing stuff. There's so many good deals out there to be found. You just have to take the time and go through all the stuff and sort through the stuff and you'll find some amazing deals too, guys. So anyways, I want to thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, friends.